this mama's house today I'm sharing with you a day in the life of a homeschool mom of five if you guys are new to my channel welcome my name is Tabitha and like I said I'm a homeschool mom to five awesome kids here's one of them right here laying next to me but today I'm gonna share with you how our day goes and just bring you guys along with. So I hope you guys are excited. I would love to have you subscribe if you are new. I post homemaking, homeschooling, and healthy lifestyle videos on this channel, and I'd love to have you join. Today's video is really exciting because it is a collaboration with Samantha Greenwall from her channel. She is an amazing homeschool mom as well. I love her content. I've been watching her for such a long time. She was one of the ladies that just really inspired me on my homeschooling journey. She is a Christian mom and she just shares so much light to this community. I think you guys will absolutely love her. So when you're done watching My Day in the Life, go over to her channel and check her out. And if you're coming from her, hi, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. So right now it is almost lunchtime. We have kind of had a slow start to our day. I shared a little bit of our morning as you guys saw already, but if you want to see a detailed morning routine on a perfect day, you can check out my productive morning routine video. I'll have it pop up in the iCards and I'll leave it down in the description box too if you wanna see like a perfect day and how our morning goes on those days. Today is not a perfect day, but it's a good day still. We got up, we did our morning chores and all of that stuff, had breakfast, and we still haven't even started school, and it is noon. It is exactly noon right now. So what I decided to do is go to the park. We're gonna have a little play date with some friends at the park before we do our school. We're gonna do an afternoon school today just because that's what works out. And that's the beauty of homeschooling. We can do things in whatever order we want. We have so much freedom to just do what works for us on each day and not every day has to be the same. So um, let me show you what the kids got done so far today and then we'll pick back up with going to the park. Oh my gosh, look at this little piece of drool. If you don't like baby drool, look away, but I think it's so cute. It just like went down. <laughs> Hi, baby. Are you drooling? Are you a drooly baby? We gotta get you dressed too. We gotta get you dressed and started with the day, don't we? So I recently found these little daily responsibility charts on Etsy. I will leave them linked down below. But for their morning chores, they literally just have these Velcro things that they move down to this done section. And this has been such a game changer. Just having my five-year-old Vinny, who does not know how to read quite yet, he can see visually what to do. And it's fun to move it down. So they've really been enjoying this. Um, looks like Bella didn't make her bed yet but then they have afternoon chores and evening chores and it just helps them to kind of stay on task 
and know what to do each day. So I've been loving these. I will leave them linked, like I said. They even have this little one with only two rows for the younger kids. So this is Louie's checklist. Nico's, I've just been leaving them on the fridge. And then we have like our daily chores here too. So it's been working out really nicely. Little Joey is all changed, aren't ya? You're all changed and ready for the day. So I'm gonna make the kids lunch now. Right here is a lunch for the kids. I have a peanut butter and jelly on some sourdough bread. And a trick for peanut butter and jelly to spread it easily is use a spoon instead of a knife. We got some carrots, apples, and then some of these Annie's cheddar bunnies. So it's time for lunch, kids. Joey is now in his swing. He is going to take a little nap. The kids are eating, and while they are eating, I am going to get the kitchen cleaned up because we didn't do dishes from breakfast yet. I got some laundry to switch over. Just kind of tidy up before we head to the park. You guys want to go to the park? Yeah! Let's do it. I've been putting on my fake smile Even though I'm wasting time I don't want to be trapped in a box Trying to be like the rest when I'm not I just want to go my own way Gonna let the past burn down Cause honestly don't wanna be Stuck in boring conversations with you With you I'm gonna leave it all behind Find myself, I'm gonna is all clean we got the dishwasher going the laundry going we are ready to go hang out at the park for a little bit with our friends we're just having a, a chill day before we start our school just got to the park. We're gonna unload everyone. Oh, that's right. And it's a beautiful day. So we're gonna have an awesome fall day, having some fun at the park. You guys ready? Oh, you stayed awake the whole ride. You guys ready to go have fun? Yeah. Let's do it. Look at that. They're not afraid at all. the park with our friends. We are going to head back home now and get to doing our schoolwork. Did you guys have fun with your friends? Yeah, we were talking about Minecraft. 
they were talking about Minecraft. I knew oh we man. Both made new friends. Yep, they're new friends, but we also go to homeschool co-op with them. So we'll see them again on Friday. Yeah. So that'll be fun. And if you notice, we're missing somebody here in the seat. Bella went with her dad early this week. She is in a wedding this weekend, so she went um, a couple days early to go spend time with her dad. So if you guys didn't know, Bella is Ryan's stepdaughter. So she is from a previous relationship. It's tough for us. We miss her on the weekends, but she is well loved by two families. So that's good for her. And we do our best to get along and make 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 it good. So we'll miss Bella, but she'll be home. So we're gonna go do school and have a good rest of the day. We are back home and we're gonna sit down at the table to do school. The kids want to play their phones. They have little iPods and they have to do their school before they can play their phones. So that's a good way to kind of limit screen time is don't do school right away in the morning, <laughs> at least for us. So we went to the park and all that, and they got a lot of fun outside time. And now we're gonna do school and they won't have their devices all day long. So, it's good, it works out for mom. What do you think about that? <laughs> what are you playing with? No, you haven't had them yet today. Look at all those Orbeez. You didn't just eat one, did you? No, I smelled it. Oh, cause we put essential oils in there. We've it's so deep. I tell you what, oh, it's, it's so cool. It's still going, it's still going, it's still going, it just stopped. Oh, Wait, there's so many. <laughs> Wait, we must have hide it then. Well, I put some of them away before we left. It feels so good. And it smells good. We put some lemon essential oil in there. We need more. <laughs> yeah, that's Nico's favorite essential oil. He's trying to sniff it. <laughs> so since it's already late in the afternoon, we're not gonna do our morning basket today. We're just going to do our morning board and then we're gonna jump right into our homeschool binders. So let me show you how I set up our homeschool binders to make it easy on me throughout the week. Each of the kids have a binder. The sun is like crazy right now. Um, but I have Monday through Friday here on the tabs. And then we just complete all of the worksheets. I rip them out of their curriculum or photocopy them, whatever I have to do. And we just stick them in here. So each day, it's super easy. We just flip to whatever day it is and they can get started on their worksheets right there. All right guys, we'll start with our morning board. Over here. Let's see if it Come on over, look at Joey's gonna join us. Can I hold Joey? Oh, Joey's gonna stand up. See it. Okay, so today is Wednesday, October 7th. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars mm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart Maybe the trees will whisper the word Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones right, who lost their hope done with school.
school. The kids are having some time on their devices. I was going to make chicken stir fry for dinner, which I thought sounded so good, but it's a lot of work. You wanna have your device too? Okay, yeah. just a second, we can get it. Um, but Ryan said that he wanted some fish sticks and fries, which that is way easier for me. I literally just have to throw this pan in the oven and we'll be good to go. So we're also gonna have some frozen green beans with it and that will be dinner. Super easy for me, I'll take it. Here's dinner, bon appetit. It is 7.30 and I'm gonna start getting the kids ready for bed. This little guy is going to take a bath tonight. Are you gonna take a bath tonight? Yes, you are. And I'm just gonna get the kids rounded up for bedtime. Bedtime takes a lot out of me. It's probably my most stressful time of day. So I'm gonna cut this video short, but I hope that this video encourages you that you don't have to have a perfect day to homeschool. Like, I woke up late today and I could have so easily just said, I don't wanna film today, I wanna skip school, I messed up the whole schedule, and I've been there. I, I in the past, have totally done that. Like, scrapped the whole day because of one little mishap or somebody throws a tan temper tantrum and I just scrapped the whole day. So I hope this video encourages you that you don't have to do things like every other YouTube mom. You don't have to do things like everybody you see on Instagram. Your homeschool is your homeschool and you get to choose how your day goes even if it's not the same as it was yesterday. So I hope that gives you a little bit of encouragement today. Send all of your positive vibes for bedtime for me. And don't forget to go check out Samantha's video after you click off of this one. She is awesome and you guys are going to love her channel. Thanks so much for being here today. We will see you in the next video. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Say bye, -bye. bye. <laughs>